Okay, so I'm going to teach you some fast food life hacks. This can be both American based and UK based, except Nando's, because Nando's is just UK based. You do have Nando's in America though, in some places like Canada, but I don't imagine it's the same. So don't pretend like you, you could be part of this whole cheeky Nando's thing because you can't stop it. Just fuck off. So we're gonna start with McDonald's, okay? Now people like to say that I'm a fussy eater. I am a fussy eater, but in this case, it actually helps me out. So when I get food from places, I am actually really fussy. Like, I, I can't have this, can't have that. Like, I'm very weird because, okay, I'm just gonna explain how weird I actually am. I like oranges. I like orange juice. I don't like orange juice with bits where it's got orange in it. Like, I like tomato sauce. Don't like tomatoes. Ah, this one's weird. I like onion rings but I don't like onions. And I like cheese when it's over, it has to be melted. It can't, it can't like, I can't eat a block of cheese. I can't eat like, on a cheeseburger, the cheese has to be melted otherwise it's fucking game over. So anyway, in McDonald's obviously, when you buy a burger, 99.9999% of the time, that burger's probably been sat there for about seven years. It's got a degree and it's had a fucking mortgage and its family's left it and it's just left there to fucking die. So there's one way that you could combat this and make sure they make you a fresh burger. You ask for it plain. Now you may be sacrificing some of the things like the onions and the fucking pickles or whatever the hell's on it, but at least it'll be fresh. So when I ask for like a double cheeseburger, I ask for a plain, they have to go into the back, get the bun, burger, cheese, bun. Like they have to make it fresh for you. They don't just go and get one, open it up and scrape it off. They hope they go and make it fresh. I watch them do it. So if you want a fresh burger, get it plain. While we're on the idea of McDonald's, let's figure out how to make a cheap Big Mac. So like, I get it. You can, you, you like the Big Mac because it's big and like, yeah, you can actually ask for Big Mac sauce on any of the burgers like if you ask for like a cheeseburger or a double cheeseburger You can say can you make that with the Big Mac sauce and the most of the most of the time they will say yeah All the times I'll be like no go fuck yourself most of the time They'll actually say yes So if you just buy free single cheeseburgers with Big Mac sauce on you've got all the bread take it apart Put it together. There you go. You got a Big Mac and it's like what two pound less or four dollars or 76 billion yen moving on to Nando's. Now these are probably well known. If you go to Nando's a lot, you probably know how to do this. So instead of buying the refillable cup for £2.50, ask for a tap water. It's the same glass and you can just go and fill it with coke. Fill it with tap water first because they'll probably be watching you. Fill it with water and be like, look at me, I'm a good citizen. But then later on, or even get a friend, like a friend who's bought a refillable drink, get them to go and fill it up for you. There you go, you can drink whatever you want and it's free. While we're on Nando's, we're going to talk about the refillable reward card. So you don't already know, you can get a reward card in Nando's and like every time you go and spend £7, you get a chili. Once you hit that red reward, your chilies go back down to zero and you have to start again. But instead of doing that, but get a new card. Like when you, when you go to Nando's next, go, oh, can I have a new card? Before you order your food, they'll be like, yeah, yeah, sure. You register it, you get two free chilies and then your order, which is seven pounds, so you get free chilies on your first go. So basically, once your Nando's card has hit zero, get them to get a new card before you order your food. Boom, there you go, free chilies on your first visit. You can get a green reward next time you go to Nando's. So that's for fast food hacks. If anyone else has got any, show them in the comment section. Uh, I'd love if you could leave a like on this video because for some fucking reason, everyone keeps disliking my videos. And it's like, if you could leave a like on the video, that'd be sweet. Or just dislike it, just join the crowd, just go and dislike the video, I know. Who the fuck wants to watch my videos? They're terrible.